Monday or Tuesday morning. This is what I walk into with my husband. It's like <laughs> the cap to the oatmeal being thrown somewhere. Oh my. Go. Oh, our backyard is destroyed. Go, baby. Go. Good morning, y'all. I just caught up, put on my cozy little robe. I'm about to make some coffee, sit down at my desk, do a little bit of work, and then um, go volunteer. But I wanted to take y'all along a little day in my life because I really just have some errands planned today. So I always like think that's a little bit more interesting. I want to show what our living room looks like right now because we just got back from this trip and this is like pretty much real life for us that like, you don't always see on instagram okay in the middle of taking down halloween decor i still have to unpack my amazon packages my husband still has to unpack more packages i need to unbox anyways so honestly this won't even probably get to today probably like tomorrow <gasps> Baba, hi, how are you? What is it? Um, I've got to take care of all my animals. So I'm about to feed Marley. She gets her farmer's dog. She tap this. I already fed my cats. I have to scoop their litter boxes. And then I can sit down at my desk and get to work. Ice, no, that's not yours. He will love to eat it. Okay, now we let Marley in. Ah, ah, ah. Sit, sit down. Sit. Are you good, girl? Give me a little kiss this morning. Okay, you can eat. Go ahead. So I'm gonna uh, unbox this Amazon stuff right now because I ordered a milk frother, a new one, because my Nespresso one has not really been working. And I know I could probably like call them and figure it out, but I have cleaned it. It's been causing me issues for like a year nonstop. And usually once I clean it, like it goes back to normal, but it's just not. So it's pretty old. I mean, well, two years, I think. Anyways, I just decided to just get a different one because my parents have this one. And it actually, I like it more, I think, because I feel like it makes your, ooh, it makes your milk warmer and I feel like it frosts it better. I don't know. Outdoor lights. We are working on our backyard, so ordered some outdoor lights for back there it can kind of get dark what i needed over the weekend i'm trying these it's called this clean towels they're like biodegradable makeup removing wipes um yeah i don't know how they work but they looked really interesting they had good reviews oh i ordered these candles for my office the like bubble candles are kind of popular cute okay it comes with a blue and a white one Oh, they smell good. They smell like soap, kind of like, I don't mind. I don't know that you really use them because I think they're more for display. Yes, look at how cute this is. I don't know where I'm gonna put the blue one, but I bought the white one to like go on my desk. Got some more maca powder. I went to use mine in the pantry the other day and I realized it was expired. So I ordered some more. I, I My old one was this kind as well from this brand. This one does not expire until 2023, so we're good. But yeah, it's really good for like energy or hormone balance. And look at those, I can't really see right there, but I've got this acne going on. Again, my milk frother. Okay, I'm gonna unbox that in just a minute. This is, oh, this is for my kitchen. I've seen people use these in their kitchen, usually with like a really pretty island, but I wanted one, so I bought it. I think I just gave myself a splinter. But you put it like by your sink and you can put like your soaps on it. And it's just like a really cute little like pedestal thing. I love how like antique it looks too. That's really cool. I honestly kind of even want to put that on my desk. Got these industrial clothing racks. I'm actually going to put these on my wall instead of like the full clothing rack I have in my office just to kind of keep things off the ground. I need Josh to do that is for we have so many mosquitoes in our backyard so i'm gonna try these i think 
our friends had this in their backyard and it would can you guys see that no and it was uh it worked really well so it's a mosquito repelling coil i think you like light this and it yeah it burns i'm gonna try that there's 10 coils in here i still need to order like a coffee table or something for our patio but at least ooh, whenever we're out there gosh this is pretty this is why i bought it because i knew it would look pretty too it's like this clay candle and it's just a pretty decent sized candle but it's that citronella that um mosquitoes hate i kind of love it cool okay i want to open up my frother and then we can try it out all together i'm gonna finish this half and half i have tons of oat milk in the fridge so i want to finish this hell is happening now now i'm starting to think maybe it's this milk but it's it's lactose free half and half so maybe it's because it has no lactose like I don't even know. It's so frustrating. Good thing though is it did make it much more hot than I'm used to. I'm just gonna pour in like, might as well just do it all. Okay. Disappointing. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna have to figure something out. What's what's going on? Whew. Okay, I just made my breakfast. I went and scheduled my newsletter. Um, changed having yogurt and some berries. I'm gonna scarf this down. I'm running really late. I'm gonna go volunteer. That usually takes me about an hour and a half. I've got some more computer stuff to do, and then I've gotta go to the gym, get ready, Trader Joe's. I need to film a project. I think that's about it for today. Okay, I am back, volunteered. I've been working a little bit on my computer. I'm going to start some laundry, or, well, yeah, let me start in here because on Tuesdays I wash my sheets. So I need to start those and put new sheets on the bed. This stuff needs to be moved to the guest room. This will get hung. Let me pull all this stuff down. Must get it all in one. Holy moly. I just pulled up to the gym. I'm about to go inside. I, mm, it is like, you guys can see, it's a cold rainy day. I'm starting my period in like two days. So it's this time in my like cycle where I'm just like really tired and I don't feel like doing anything. Like yesterday, I did not want to work out either. Um, so I think I'm gonna, just get on the treadmill, run as much as I can, even if it's like five minutes, and then get off and I'm gonna do like a full body strength workout. I just don't really feel like doing a lot of like jumping and hit. Um, I am gonna do my jump rope. I do a three minute jump rope every single day. So that, a little bit of running, but mainly just like strength training today. Um, then I'm gonna go to Trader Joe's because we have zero food. I'm feeling pasta or soup tonight, honestly. One of the two. <laughs> okay, let's go inside. It's done. My run. I'm gonna sit here. And pull up my hit workout. And do that. Or no, it's not hit, it's street training. Trader Joe's. It's been way too long. I got look at all these flowers I got. I'm gonna make like a really pretty fall bouquet. And then I got more eucalyptus mm, for my shower. I keep some in my shower. And then I just like let it dry up. Um, so thought I'd refresh that. I'll do that in a little bit. Um, I'm gonna show you like a really fast. What's it called? Haul. I have not been to Trader Joe's in like so long, but I had a lot of fun. I tried only buying things like I could only really get there. 
because I prefer to shop at my market street because I can like build points and get rewards and stuff like that. Um, so I did get a few things that I can get somewhere else, but I'm just gonna start unloading. Okay, okay, okay. got this vegetable medley for my chicken pot pie, but then I didn't get anything else for my chicken pot pie. So I just have vegetables right now. I'm gonna have to go back to the grocery store whenever I make it. You know what I went in for? They're full zoo, whatever kind of pasta. So good. Got some cream cheese, half and half. Ooh, I love these guys. I'm probably gonna have some right now, but they're, what's her, the mini heirloom tomatoes, but they're in like a full, I'm gonna put these in a bowl and display them, but then also eat on them with like some ranch. Dr. Prager's, they're actually really good. Um, So I'll just eat these sometimes for lunch with like ketchup and some vegetables, like the, I would eat this with some tomatoes. What? I have not tried, but it intrigued me. Corvella. So, got that one, and I got my usual, I like to get this from Trader Joe's Gentleman's Collection. It's really good. Cream cheese, and then this everything with the bagel, salmon, and then I got bagels. Here's my bagels for the week. Okay, now we're getting to the good stuff. Okay, I want to show you all the meats I bought. I do like Trader Joe's meat, but it's just expensive. Like, I can get it way cheaper than my other grocery store. So I got the carne asada. It's so delicious. Throw this in the crock pot. It's like an easy, easy meal and it's like full of flavor. I just grabbed some like chicken, some ground beef. I'm going to make, I think, spaghetti or something like that tonight. Okay, and then I love their chicken sausages. I, chicken sausage. I haven't tried this one, the smoked but I have tried spicy Italian and it's really good. Um, this is maple chicken breakfast sausage. So I don't know, I'm just kind of like feeling like changing up my breakfast. I also this morning, like I'm just sick of yogurt right now. It just doesn't sound very good. So we're, sw we're switching it up. Bagels, breakfast sausage, all of it. Then here's some other not so healthy items. I like to eat this one for lunch, the brown rice and quinoa. Got some rigatoni. See, I might make the rigatoni tonight and like do like a sausage spaghetti. That sounds delicious. And I needed some more white rice. So I got some jasmine rice. This is one of my favorite soups of theirs. I will never get over it. It's the tomato and roasted red pepper soup. I also got some of these, <laughs> which I never really get, but I haven't been to Trader Joe's in so long. So I was just like, hmm. We should just get them because you know they're good. Mmm. Super sour. Get the arabiata sauce that I might use tonight. I also got their Autumn Harvest Creamy Pasta Sauce. Josh doesn't really like this because it has it's like a butternut squash taste. I think it's amazing. So I might do this with the fall pasta tonight i'm not sure in the mood like to cook some brownies or like fall cookies or something so i grabbed just some brownie this is their truffle brownie baby mix delicious i've not tried this before but i love french onion soup so i got these it comes with two of them they look really good these are so good i love to eat these as a snack the chicken cilantro wontons and then this, I think I'm going to eat right now, is the corn and quinoa salad. So I might make that really quickly and just eat on a tortilla if we have them. Pretty. I love the berries, the red with the green. It's like a pretty Christmas bouquet. I'm gonna put some water in it. And I'll 
style it.